Hey there everyone, you can call me Truskles and welcome back to Bramble the Mountain King. When we last left off, we committed our first murder by putting 28 stab wounds into a forest creature's face. To be fair, it did try to kill us first. And we even tried to spare its life a couple times, and in response it killed us. So, you know, I don't feel too bad about it anymore. Especially after learning that apparently it was a siren responsible for multiple deaths and missing persons cases. And it also resulted in a giant fucking witch hunt and it was just not good for anyone. The old woman with the rake we've heard pretty much nothing about other than she brings disease and plague with her. Yeah, motherfucker, come on, let's go. Ah, fuck me. Ooh. Fucking hate that. Are you just gonna sit here and... ominously? Okay, there you go. I figured something like that was gonna happen. Oh, shit!
we're back. God dang it. And we be done with this shit, I hope. I think. Maybe. Yes. Pesta. That was her name. And every time I, like, hear about a character, I think, oh, they might be cool. Nope, it's just someone else who wants to kill me. Also, I look a little too calm about what just happened. He had overcome the darkness. Did I? He had reached the mountain. He could finally find his sister. Land ho, boys! Hey, I got my shine back. Oh. Everything turning gray doesn't look great. I mean, it looks fantastic, but it's probably not good. Oh, a blood river! My favorite! How am I swimming through this? I really thought that the current would, like, push me through the bramble. Damn it, and now I'm all covered in blood. This is great. In local news, young child completely covered in blood were seen raving and ranting running through the wilderness. More on that at 10. As he reached the summit. Oh Olaf shit, this is regret. This is the climb to the creepy sister vision. He could not stop his sister from being taken. Regret could not stop the woman from drowning her child. Regret yet killed the shapeshifter in the forest. Stood before him, and he wished he could ask their forgiveness. Feel like we're close to beating the game maybe he had reached the end that tuva had pointed him towards now entering the halls of the mountain ulle was ready to find his sister oh story from before? <laughs> Exhausted, all storybooks. bloody, and at his wit's end, King Nils came to a witch's house on the outskirts of his kingdom. He fell to his knees, begging the witch to help cure his son, and she agreed. The witch explained that the flower held tremendous power that could only very carefully be used for good. 
the witch instructed he only use a single petal, using the whole bloom would only invite death. Ulrich began to recover, but discontent at the royal line had grown in the kingdom following King Nils' bloody campaign. The next day, King Nils found his son dead, and the last light holding his darkness at bay was snuffed out. Heartbroken, King Nils turned to the bloom which had promised life, and instead saw it as an escape from his suffering. The witch, having come to visit the king and the prince, looked at the nightmarish scene in despair. She raised a mountain on top of King Nils and shackled him using the same bramble that he let loose upon the kingdom. And to this day, the trolls still feed him as punishment for his evil deed. So it's six something ten. There it is. Six two ten. What? You just put on someone else. Oh my god, kid! Six. So I take it I was right, and I am the little prince, somehow. duck behind this thing when that thing dropped. Oh yeah.
Oh yeah, this definitely feels like some end game shit. The trolls feed him the as mountain punishment. Mountain King so... who was meant to be hidden forever was now revealed. This is where he my sister would have been taken. The sack before Lilimur ended up as the giant's dinner. It'd be weird if it was just my sister in there, right? There's got to be more kids in there. Just gonna watch this happen. Oh, yeah, that was a crunch if I've ever fucking heard it. Also, I just realized that this is in the Hall of the Mountain King playing right now. Ow! Fuck. Gotcha, bitch. Okay, so maybe he has me. Just maybe. This is so cool! I love this! This is so cool! I love this! 
Okay, so I am supposed to hide behind the rocks there. Ah, oh, fuck, I walked right into that one. Fuck me! Oh! Oh, fuck! Oh no, I jumped too soon! Booyah! But the bramble weakened. Mountain King saw clearly for the first time in centuries. And what he saw reminded him of his beloved son. He would not lose him again. This time, King Nils would overcome the darkness. by tossing his son so far to the fucking concrete. in his back and brought it all to an end. The only way to get to Lilimur was now up and in. You're shitting me, dude. Definitely dead. Didn't he crunch her? Definitely remember a distinctive crunch. Tuva had one last gift to give to Ole. Do we have to play the sister now? 
this. Always look after his friend. I was gonna say, that better not be credits. A nightmare woke her up. Frightened by her memories. She searched for her brother's comfort. But he was nowhere to be found. What? What? All the toys I collected. I just got a trophy saying that I completed the game. However, the darkness outside did not scare her. She knew she had her brother. <laughs> that was fucking fantastic, dude. was so good. I don't know why everyone, I mean, I guess I could kind of see why everyone was saying that was Limbo-esque with uh, how brutal it was, but I, honestly, it was giving me more Little Nightmares vibes. Um, holy shit, man, that game got dark, that game got adorable, that game got funny. This is just a fucking gem. This game is awesome. I'm so happy I finally- this came to consoles. I wonder if there's any way to get an alternate ending or anything. I'm gonna have to look that up. Oh, that, man, this soundtrack has been just awesome. So fucking good. And epic. everybody this was a wonderful game a wonderful time playing this game I had a wonderful time playing this game and oh man hey that's like the first game I've beaten on the channel since I started editing videos so hey Chuck won that that one up as a win anyway I will see you guys in the next one. I'm going to go ahead and let these credits play out because, come on, a game as awesome as this, these people deserve to have their names be seen. So I'm going to leave you all here, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.